Hey guys, welcome to Nobu Creative Digital Market Agency. I hope you guys are doing great. <laughs> if yes, then glory be to God. So in today's tutorial, I'm going to be teaching you how to design a copy player, design social media design, or your smartphone, which is PC Lab. So without wasting much of time, let's get them to the business of today. So the first thing you have to do right now is to click on your plus button and click on ship. Actually, you click on this thing like this. You keep it. You just increase the little bit. Increase it. Increase it. So after you've increased it, make sure it is where okay with this. And after that, just let me say, let me increase it a little bit. So after you that, you go to your green color, then you give me actually this. Um, what I use. So let me show you the uh, what they call it. Let me show you the color code for it. So the color code for this, the first one, which is the one at the middle, this one at the middle. So let me show you this color code for it. So the color code is EC AA. 5c ec a a 5c so that is the color code for the one at the middle so the one yeah so the one outside it which is this actually this one this um what they call it the chocolate color so let me show you the color code so the color code is 3d 1 to 1 b 3d 1 to 1 b so in case you want it you can actually get the color code like that so let's go down to the business after that just decrease it a little bit decrease it still decrease it they increase it like this increase this place okay good so we are going so after that the next thing i'm going to do right now is to go to display where my pink sorting is then you click on color then you change it to white background so can you see we are moving forward good so after that the next thing i'm going to do right now is to click on your layer then you Lock this one. So after you locked it, the next thing you are going to do right now is to click on your plus button. You click from gallery, then you bring out the image <laughs> you want to use. So sorry for this. <coughs> so this is the image I want to use. The image I want to use. So this is actually the image I want to use. Good. So I have to bring out crop it, crop it very well, crop it a little bit, crop it, crop it very well. So crop it very well, crop it. So after you crop it, just reduce it a little bit, then you actually place it somewhere around there. So after you place it on somewhere around, you can lock it. So after you lock it, the next thing you going to do is to click from the gallery again. Then you bring out another, what they call it, another image I want to use. So this is actually the image I want to use. So just crop it a little bit because of something that is there. Crop it. Good. So, good. So after you crop it, the next thing you're going to do right now is to just place it here. Place it here. So after you press it, then the next thing you're going to do is to click on your layer. Then you long press display, you long press it, then you move to the back or the first one you, 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 you bring out. So can you see we are moving forward? So after that, the next thing you're going to do right now is to click on your plus button, then you click on shape, then you increase this radius, you increase it to 100. So after you increase it to 100, then you place it on top of here, just place it here. Good, then so you give it this color actually this color this color so the color i think the color we use sorry so i think the color is this color code is 5b 1f15 5b 1f15 so that is the color code for this so let's go so you give it this color so you make sure it's at the middle so you go to your relative position then you place it at the middle so good so after that you duplicate it then you give it white color, you go to your color, then you give it exactly white color. So after you give it white color, the next thing you're going to do is just to place it somewhere around there. Just place it there. So can you see it? Just place it around there. So good. So it is quite good. So the next thing I'm going to do is um so it um I'm going to write best quality, best quality. So I'm going to write in B. This is how I want to be because I'm using stylish font so this is something good so i thought i just place it on top of here <coughs> sorry for that so after that you go to your color then you change it to that this is actually good so you go to your phone then change it to another phone which is i use something this so i'm going to be showing you the color i think it's something conservation so i'm going to check out the name very well then you, then give it at the description so let's go for it Good. So I think this one is okay. So after that, the next thing you're going to do right now is to click on your uh, plus button. You click on test, then you write your copy in capital letter. Good. Change the capital letter, then you increase it a little bit. Increase it. Increase it a little bit. Then you place it here. So after that, you go to your font. 
go to your phone then you give it white color so after you give it white color you go to start that is color so you go to your phone then you give it something they call uh what they call it they call it revic 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 free board so you can actually get it um this thing from google just type uh download the uh, the uh, font good so just make sure it's at the middle also so can you see good so after that the next thing you're going to bring out nice you click from a gallery then you bring out a leaf um i don't want anyone to come in now so you bring out this leaf i'm looking for the leaf so actually i think this is the leaf so just crop it crop it because there's something there crop it very well crop it good so after you crop it just place it all around there just place it around there just place it around there good so after you have placed around there, the next thing you going to do is to click on your plus button you click on test then you click then i have copied something before so let me bring it out so you can just write anything there anything like the one that the client gave to you you just write it there so that so that to make your work look more beautiful so just okay, like, then you go to your font you give it popping so i use popping medium for it popping medium good so popping medium for it so just decrease a little bit then you place it somewhere like this good so this is actually what i want for it to be uh to be justified so it needs to be aligned together so i'm gonna give it to your phone then you give it this color so that is white color it is showing good now oh you can actually give it something bold so let's go for popping bold if that one can <coughs> bold so let's go for popping bold let's see if it's going to make sense good so it's making sense and i can see everything here clearly so what are we going to do next now so the next thing i'm going to do is to click on your plus button you click on sticker then you remove it so this is the sticker i want actually this one so i want this one actually so after that just just do something like this then after you do it like this then you go to your rotate 3d rotate then you give it you give it white y axis y axis actually y axis so that's what that is good for it so you have to um rotate it like this good so after you rotate it the next thing you're going to do is to click on the layer then you move to the back of the plate good so, that, so that's go to the back of the plate so after that you are done with that the next thing i'm going to do is to duplicate it again then you go to your 3d rotate okay i should have actually do it before then you rotate it you rotate it rotate it something like this rotate it so you cannot place it here so you go to your what they call it you go to your color then you change the color actually to the um to this you are using actually this so i thought that the next thing to do is to place it that is a place it on uh, under the the cover so let's go so go so it's under the cover right now so you have to place it so that it won't show you can actually lock the coffee you can actually lock so that you can actually so that it won't be disturbing us so good so this is actually what i want good so this is what i want so let this one go back to the normal position here so after that next thing we are going to do right now is to duplicate it then place it somewhere around here so cool so we are good to go so after that the next thing you're going to do right now is to click the plus button click on shape you give it radius 100 opacity is zero then you give it um stroke around three or four so i'm think i'm going with this so you give it color which is this color so you increase the opacity a little bit this time the stroke a little bit so after increasing the next thing you're going to do right now is to place it all around there good 
So after you place the corner, you just leave it like this. So the next thing you can see right now. So click in your shape, give it this. Call me bro. Then you give it something this. So you place it here like this. So good. So can you see this making sense right now? So you can actually adjust this one a little bit. So let me adjust this to a little bit. So, so let me put this one very well. So can you see this actually what I want? So after that, let's able to do right now. So you click on this, duplicate it, then you delete it. Then you write the this. You can actually increase the size in here. So they can actually print it here. So you can use it, use it here now. Good. So I thought that the next thing you're going to do is to click on this best quality. Yeah, click on it. Then you write. Then you write um good. So write it like this. Good coffee. Good coffee. Good mood. So you place it like this. So after you place it like this, just bring it down here. Rotate it like this. Rotate it like this. So after you rotate it, the next thing you're going to do is to go to your cup. Cough, cough, then you actually give it something like this. So you just give it minus, so you just let it cough a little bit, let it cough it very well. So we can actually increase, reduce the size a little bit right now. So let it cough it very well. So let's go back to the size and let us reduce it so that it can actually go away. So the cough is too much. So we're going to go back to the cough, then let's reduce it a little bit. Okay, good. So this is actually what. I want so can you see good copy good mode so after we are done with that the next thing we are going to do right now just put it up a little bit just put it up a little bit then go to your rotate and uh, rotate then you rotate it a little bit <coughs> I'm sorry so let's rotate it a little bit good good so let me do it like this good so after that next thing you're going to do right now so you click on your plus button click from gallery then you click on social media social media icon so i'm always going well with this actually it's okay for me so you change the color to this color we are using actually this so you can actually put it here Place it under here. So after you place it under here, actually increase it to know what you are doing. You just zoom your work to know what you are doing. So just zoom it all around here. So after you zoom it, then check what I'm doing. Good. Oh. So just put it around there. Good. So the next thing you're going to do right now is click on your plus button, click on shape, then you click on radius. Then you do something like this, then you give it actually this the same color we are using. Okay, that is stroke color. So you have to reduce it very well. So good. So there's something I need to do. I need to um I need to reduce some things and to reduce this split and to reduce this right now. So this is what I need to do right now. So this two also I need to reduce it also. So let me go to the size and reduce it. So good. So this is what I actually need right now. So these two need to go in like this. So I need to <clears throat> to actually work on these two. Good. So these two actually need to go like this. Good. So this one now needs to come up a little bit so I can write something under it. Good. So this is what I need right now. Good. So the next thing I'm going to do right now is to click on this. On this, then you write the name of 
So let me just write at wood at wood.com at wood at wood covey. So go just write the name of the person. Then give it the same color we are using. So what is the same color? So let's give it this thing. I can actually zoom your work so I can place it to white and let it big a little bit. So let's increase it a little bit. Then place it somewhere all around there. So let's zoom it back. So can you see it is very clear right now? So let me go back to the shape. Um, I brought that the other time. So where's the shape? Good. So let's work on the shape right now. Zoom it and let it discredit a little bit. We are almost done. So you go to your relative position and let it and make sure that it's at the middle. Good. So the next thing, just copy this wood. You copy this. Then you write, delete it. Then you write order now. Change the capital letter. Then you move it. Yeah, then you can zoom your work again to place it very well. I think we are almost done with this, so increase it to bit. Good. So next thing I'm going to do just uh, duplicate it. Then you write your number here. Good. So you can actually. Give it a color and um, which is the same color we are using don't forget the color code so you just zoom it back and let's see what we are doing so you actually drag it sorry so let me lock all this so let's go back so what's what is um the what i just do right now so let me look for it so good so this is it good it is aligned with that so can you see it so can you see that it is neat right now so what i'm going to bring up now just only one thing for me to bring up next and um, which is this click so they call it click i call it click i need to click so just rotate it a little bit rotate, rotate it like this then you have to decrease it decrease it a little bit decrease it very well then just zoom your work again zoom it very well they place it here. Cool. So let's see what we do. So can you see we are done with the work and the work is very neat and it's very fine. So that is all for two days. So that's all we get for today. Yeah. So thank you for watching us now. Thank you. So just click on your disk, then you save it as a project, then you save it as image. Save it as PNG, then as very high or ultra. So I don't want to say because I've saved it before. So that is the end of the tutorial. Just smile like there's no one watching Early morning on a Saturday Wake up, it's time to get it started No one's gonna get in your way Yeah, your feelings gonna leave you broken hearted